Am I the asshole? For asking my husband to join us in my sister's birthday since he was in the same restaurant? IF26 was invited to my sister's 18th birthday a few days ago at a restaurant. My husband didn't come because he said he had a meeting dinner with some clients. This made my family feel let down especially my sister who wanted him there and also her 18th birthday was a big deal to her obviously. To my surprise, when I arrived I noticed that my husband was having his meeting at the same place, his table was right in the corner and he had about four men sitting with him. My parents and the guests saw him as well. I waved for him and he saw me but ignored me. He obviously was as much as surprised as I was. My parents asked why he didn't even come to the table to acknowledge them after the cake arrived. I got up and walked up to his table. I stood there and said excuse me, my husband was silent when I asked after I introduced myself to the clients if he'd take few minutes to join me and the family in candle blowing and say happy birthday but he barely let out a phrase and said I don't think so, I'm busy right now. I insisted saying it'd just take a couple of minutes and that it'd mean so much to my sister. He stared at me then stared awkwardly, back at his clients. They said nothing and he got up after my parents were motioning for me to hurry up. He sat with us while my sister blew the candles and cut the cake. My parents insisted he takes a piece and join us in the selfie but he got up and walked back to his stable looking pissed. We haven't talked till we met later at home. He was upset and started scolding me in front of my parents saying I embarrassed him and made him look unprofessional and ruined his business meeting. I told him he overreacted since it only took few minutes and it was my sister's birthday and my family wanted him to join since he was literally in the same restaurant. He called me ignorant and accused me of tampering with his work but I responded that ignoring mine and my family's presence was unacceptable. We argued then he started stonewalling me and refusing to talk to me at all. FYI I didn't have an issue with him missing the event, but after seeing that he was already there then it become a different story. Also it literally took 5-7 minutes. He didn't even eat nor drink. Just sat down and watched. You're the asshole he was working, you knew from the start he was working, you could have told your parents and guests he was working. Instead, you went over and interrupted an important dinner. It's fine to make your sister's birthday about her, but it's not okay to make your husband's meeting about her. You're the asshole the second hand embarrassment I felt because of this is insane. It seems like nobody in your family knows how business dinners and meetings work. What a bunch of childish individuals. Info do you earn enough to support both you and your husband if he were to lose his job? You're the asshole. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Have you never had a job? You're the asshole. You have never had a professional job have you? It was so important for him to be there, why didn't you guys move the dinner celebration to another date? Upon seeing him at the same restaurant. You should have acted like you didn't even know him since this was a business meeting with clients. Yes OMG. You're the asshole. WTF? You have to ask? He was in a business meeting. That was so cringe to even read I feel so bad for him omg. You're the asshole. Hope you possibly have a job that can take care of both of you cause this stuff can literally get someone fired. You, your parents and sister should apologize for causing him problems at work now. Don't get how you don't think you were in the wrong at all. You're the asshole he was at the restaurant for work not for pleasure. This was extremely unprofessional and disrespectful to him. You potentially jeopardized his relationship with his clients and his job. You're the asshole your husband was in the middle of a business meeting he told you that he was busy and you still decided to be selfish and pester him until he came and joined you. You absolutely made him look unprofessional and embarrassed him in front of his clients. I don't know why you seem to think that an 18th birthday should take priority over your husband's business meeting. Once the meeting was over he could have joined in then, but you had to have him do it right then and there. Massive sense of entitlement on your part. My goodness op, are you really 26? The cluelessness is astounding. Ignoring mine and my family's presence was unacceptable. Lady, he skipped your events to go to work. He was at work. What you did is the same as walking into a boardroom and demand that he leave his meeting to come watch someone blow out some candles. You interrupted his work and wouldn't listen when he said no. OMGOP is the kind of person who makes WFH hell, isn't she? The door opener, the one who sends the kids out harass their father because he's home, why is he always pretending to work for 8 hours a day? For You're the asshole. How are you 26? That was childish behavior I'd expect from a six-year-old who didn't understand daddy was working and shouldn't be interrupted. No, you very much should not have interrupted his business meeting and then made him watch your sister blow out candles. 
Nothing says I'm an adult now like putting a birthday cake above work responsibilities. You're the asshole. Jesus H. Christ. He was in a business meeting with clients. You and your family have just humiliated your husband and yourselves in front of his clients. What you did was so very wrong, I can't understand how any of you thought it was acceptable. What on earth is wrong with you and your family? You're the asshole what on earth were you thinking? The world does not revolve around you and your cross this does not have an impact on his career. What you did was very rude. You're the asshole. This wasn't an evening out with friends, this was a professional engagement which is more or less the same as being at work. It makes no difference that it happened to be in the same place. He had things to do which were far more important than breaking off to sing happy birthday to your sister and you strong-armed him into it after he already said no. It's frankly ridiculous that you wouldn't see how wrong that is. Let's make this easy. Not sure what you do for work, but let's imagine you're having a meeting with your supervisor. Your husband is coming to pick you up to give you a ride home. He sees a mutual friend across the street and starts talking to them. How would you feel if he came in, interrupted your meeting with your supervisor saying come say hi to friend, it will only take a few minutes. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. He was at work. You're the asshole if I were in your position I would have given him a little thumbs up from the distance and mouthed good luck. Then after the party I would have waited for him with a piece of cake and asked him how the meeting went. That's what a supportive wife would do. Humongous you're the asshole. Note that your husband's clients said nothing while you pestered him to join you. No go ahead, Jim. We're fine here. Which suggests they weren't fine with the interruption that you might have done some real damage. Also note how unanimous the verdicts are here, rare on Reddit. You're the asshole it was a work meeting. Would you do the same if he was inside an office? That was incredibly inconsiderate and selfish. What the fuck is wrong with you? Of course your husband ignored you, he was working. To you it's just a few minutes, for him it's a giant wrench in his work meeting and now his client's colleague are probably wondering why he took them to the same restaurant as y'all. You just made his job way harder. You're the asshole for sure. You're the asshole and you clearly don't respect your husband if you think interrupting his work meeting for birthday cake was more important. Wow. You're the asshole. He was working and with clients no respect for his work. Just wow. You knew he was having a meeting from the start. You're the asshole. He was working. How would you react if your husband would show up at work, insist that you walk away from it for a piece of cake? You are way out of line here. He was working do you not realize how unprofessional you made him look? Of course you're the asshole. Damn I love it when the whole comment section agree. You're ignorant and definitely you're the asshole. Major you're the asshole. His business meeting was way more important than your sister's birthday you're the asshole. Yikes this must have been so embarrassing for him. I mean I'm cringing just imagining this whole scenario and how he must have felt walking back to his clients. Seriously lady you're the asshole. An ignorant one. You're the asshole, apologize to him. If you or your parents didn't know that the business meeting was important to him and that's why he couldn't attend you all need a reality check. You're the asshole. Big time. It's no way you can't think you're an asshole everything you typed out make you an asshole you're the asshole. He was in a business meeting you're the asshole. You're the asshole, you could have cost him his job. Do you understand that or are you that ignorant? Learn how to read the room. You're the asshole. You and your family ruined his meeting. Which was clearly very important because he tried to ignore you all. I don't know how you think you're not in awe when you messed with his livelihood. You're the asshole. He was busy working. Not hanging out with his buddies. You're the asshole he was working dealing with clients he wasn't there to have fun and you could have ruined it so yes you're a major asshole who's very selfish. Yeah. Learn to read a room and if that doesn't work, maybe listen to what your husband is saying? Attitude. You're the asshole. Big one you acted like a child and a spoiled brat at that and deserved the scolding that you got and lots more. He should write you off as the liability that you so clearly are. Edited. You're the asshole he was working with clients interrupting that meeting to celebrate a birthday would be completely unprofessional. You're the asshole. He was at work. Would you stroll into his office and do the same? You're the asshole he was in a meeting you shouldn't have approached him. Wow yes you're the asshole I can't imagine how embarrassing it must be to be sat with clients and have someone come over to you and demand you watch someone else blow out birthday candles. You put him in such an awkward position and potentially jeopardizes his client meeting. You're the asshole. 
Why would you put your sister's birthday above his job? You're the asshole. It was a business meeting he was doing his job and your sister is old enough to understand that. Stop being so childish.